Welcome to the Mysteries at the Museum. Today, we will be discussing about the crazy mystery of the lost Confederate gold. So, when the South eventually lost the war in April of 1865, a major mystery was shadowing the Union's great victory. The country was torn by conflict, and they desperately needed all the money they could to get their hands on to rebuild the United States of America. This is why the North was more than eager to get their hands on the Confederate War Treasury. But the Yankees were in for a surprise. The gold was nowhere to be found. To this day, no one truly knows what happened to the Confederate gold. Many theorize that it was divided up and buried by many plantation owners to wait for the day when the South would rise once again. Others say it was robbed by a ragtag team of Confederate and Union deserters, never to be seen again. Others still maintain that it just disappeared. There are many legends about the location of this great treasure. One stash is said to be in Savannah, Georgia, buried in a cemetery under the name of a fake general. Another is supposedly in West Central Broward County, buried by an ambushed general who was trying to take it into Cuba. However, most of those stashes are probably nothing more than legends. Although, no one truly knows where the gold is hidden. The actual value of the treasury was probably somewhere around half a million dollars. Many times less than many unions generally reported. This means that if they were indeed stashes, there are either a lot less of them than most people think or they're much smaller. Still, that does not stop people from theorizing. One particularly juicy rumor concerns a town called Danville, Virginia. Very reliable historical proof suggests that a former Confederate Navy official, James A. Semple, had a large amount of Mexican silver dollars thought to be a part of the Confederate treasure. In the area, some say they have even found some of these coins. And that, ladies and gentlemen, or just gentlemen, is why it is one of the greatest mysteries of the Reconstruction era of somewhere in the 1800s. 1860s, that's it. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching my amazing um, Mysteries at the Museum, Episode 2, The Lost Confederate Coins.